Hey guys, this is iMovie How To showing you iMovie tutorials. Today I'll be showing you how you can manage events. So, as an example, we have two events right now special effects and example. First thing I'll show you is how you can move one clip from one event to the other event. So, first, I'm going to select a clip, I can shift click it to select all of it, and to move, the event from one event to the other, I just drag it over to the other event. Then you'll see this like this blue outline over it. You just drag it there. It gives you a confirm message. Click OK. And it will move the clip into the event. What I will show you next is how you can merge events. So first, you need to select both events. You need to select the two events or three or four you want to merge together. So, for example, I want to merge special effects and example together. I can either hold down the command key to select one of the events or the shift key to select multiple events. So now, once I have selected them, I go to the file menu and select merge events. Then a, a box will appear saying, we well, want to name the merged events. I can just press OK for now. You can name it whatever you want. Then a loading bar will appear. Then the combined event will be in your project window. If you want to split your event in half, you need to select the clip that you want the event to appear first. So now you go to the file, split event before selected clip. And now it will rename it for you. Call it special effects example one, just duplicate the name so now I can right click on it. Now I can double click on the event and rename it to special effects or whatever you want. And now I can also rename this one. And your events are back split into two. Next I'll show you how you can delete an event. So first you need to select the event and go to file, move event to trash. One more thing I will show you is how you can delete an individual clip or a bunch of clips from your event. Let's just find a clip I would want to delete. So let's just do, I can delete something like this. If I, want to, if I would want to delete this clip, I would go to this X. I would click on this X icon and it will put it into a rejected library. Or I can press delete. Or I can press the delete key. So then go down to where it says show and click rejected only. Once you go to the rejected only section to delete your rejected clips, you can just click on Move Rejected to Trash. If you want to bring back some of your deleted clips, you'll just click on them. And then click on the blank star, which means it's just normal. That means it's a favorite, and that means trash it. So we can go, you can just make it normal. And let's just say you want to delete all these clips. Let's just restore that one. And we can say Move Rejected to Trash. It will say, are you sure? You say yes. You have to trash. Process. And it moves to trash. So we can actually go to our trash can and see. It made, while doing this tutorial, it made three tempor I'm going to be temporary folders. And that's where our actual trash items are. So go here, we can actually see the green screen explosion we trashed. Thank you for watching this iMovie tutorial. To see my other tutorials, Please click on the video above. Subscribe to me so you can receive future iMovie videos. Leave your questions and comments below. Thank you for watching this video.